Hello everyone, my name is Terry Prosim and welcome to Let's Play Tales from the Borderlands. It has been a while since last time I played this, uh, since uh, I've been a bit busy with my life, uh, but uh, finally I got some time uh, to record again. So, without uh, further uh, thinking about this, let's just uh, start episode 4, Escape Plan Bravo. Also, last time I think, well, we are going to get recap uh, right about the now. The darkest so... moment in any hero's tale usually comes just when things are finally falling into place. Our unlikely heroes have discovered the unfinished, top secret project of the doomed Atlas Corporation. The Gortis robot. Which is also Searching really the robot's cute. Missing components robot. made the dream of the vault seem closer than ever. Even though the former middle manager was still haunted by the demented ghost of Hyperion Pass. Enjoy that body while it's still young. Unfortunately, any dream can quickly uh. turn into a nightmare. And this nightmare's name was Valerie. Fortunately, yeah, I don't like Valerie's her. killing spree was interrupted when another dangerous adversary was suddenly revealed as a powerful ally. Now, supported by a legendary gladiator, Too bad it search was only temporary. the icy waste of the borderlands to a forgotten Garden of Eden. There, they found another piece of the Gortis robot, as well as the last surviving man on the Gladiator's murder bucket list. As she prepared to take revenge, I made a the con artist intervened. That was the moment that Valerie chose to strike. Outgunned and outmaneuvered, the con artist and salary man were forced to surrender. Also, now. We have no idea where Wong is, if I remember and correctly. And their first job was likely to be their last. Well... That was interesting. Looks like we're in for some showers. Oh, awesome. Yeah, let's let's do that. Can't wait. Are you thinking? It looks like you're you're thinking. <laughs> that suit he's wearing. It looks familiar, but I hmm, I can't place it. Yeah. And I have yeah. no idea where it's what from because I don't know all this. story behind. I can't figure it out. Story yet. <laughs> Endless march down memory lane. It's gotta Must be, be payback. It. It's gotta be some sort of payback. <laughs> I have no Think? idea. Look, there's a long list of people we've only just recently pissed off. I'm sure it's one of those assholes looking for revenge. Well, that is a pretty long list. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we should do something. If we get to those hills, maybe we could lose him. I don't know. What's he gonna do, huh? Shoot us both? I seriously doubt that. Don't Better be, be careful. He has a gun. So? He clearly needs us for something. If he wanted to shoot us, he already would have. <laughs> I think all the well, shots good to the point. head are taking their toll. But that hasn't helped. <laughs> I'm making a break for it. And you should too. Remember, <laughs> zigzag when you run, okay? It uh, makes you harder to hit. That sounds stupid. It's not stupid. <laughs> it's genius. All right. Going on three. One. Yeah, let's go for it. Three, go! <laughs> Freeze. You're making fool of yourself. Meteors? Meteor shower. Get to the shelter. Duck. Duck. No kidding. What's that? Uh, this again. 
<laughs> I can't trust you two, so you just I wouldn't have been taped up if uh, I was stayed. Taken. And you were stuck under Valerie's gun. It was a rocket launcher, okay? It was massive. Even for her. So, time to hear rest of the story. At least uh, up till uh, episode hey. 4. I mean, Stop five. It, please. You know what I mean. Not so rough. Yes, ma'am. Sorry, boss. The nerd is gone. Some old dude with crazy hair ran off with it. That's okay. We've got what's important. Hmm. Well, uh, at least the one is uh, upset. okay, I'll I guess. Answer your questions, please. Just. Promise that you won't hurt anyone. Of course, dear. I don't want to hurt anyone that's being cooperative. Don't, don't trust, trust her, her. Gordis. Oh, don't listen to her. She's just being sore. Besides, if you don't tell me, <laughs> I have to start hurting people again. And you don't want that, do you? No! Now, tell me about the Vault of the Traveler. The... The Vault of the Traveler teleports all over the universe, only staying in one spot for a few minutes before blinking away. But once I have my last piece, the beacon that's up on Helios, I can summon the Vault and hold it here. Then you collect treasure or something. What does the beacon look like? I... I don't know. But I'll know it when I see it. That's what happened mm. with the last piece. Well, that's some exciting news. Thank you, Gorgeous. You're... you're welcome. Can I get away from you now? Of course. <laughs> Look yeah, at that you looks know. really Just heavy. so angry. <sighs> Is this about Athena? You're feeling Thanks guilty. That's what Leave her alone. You can't blame yourself. Athena made her own. You couldn't fight fair. Couldn't fight fair, could you? Had to call in some goons to take her on. Goons? I wouldn't call Brick and Mordecai that. They're highly trained vault hunters, and they deserve your respect. Now listen up. Under normal <laughs> circumstances, your rotting corpses would already be getting torn apart by skags right now. But these are not normal circumstances. And with that last piece being on Helios, mm. I can't think of a better crew than a pair of Pandoran con artists and a Hyperion stooge to figure out a way to get it for me. What do you say? And I'll give you a hint. The only right answer is yes. You don't buy any of this bullshit. What's in it uh, This for is us? not a negotiation. What's in it for us? What's in it for you? Well, for starters. We keep our lives? Oh, oh dear. Things like this will stop happening. Does that work for you? Or do you think we should negotiate more? Hey! Sorry, What's Sasa. Be, Fiona? Don't give in. I I'm fine. Hey, you said you wouldn't hurt anyone. No, I said I didn't want to hurt anyone that cooperates. Uh, uh, yes, whatever you want. Please. Just, yes. Just leave her alone. I'm glad we were able to work this out. You didn't have to do that. Yeah, you shouldn't have given in. Shut up. What the hell is wrong with you two? <clears throat> We've got principles. Son. Yeah. Be a dear and help them come up with a plan. Yes, we don't need him. Let's get cracking. We need one. I'm telling you, it's not possible. We can't do this. That's not an option. Neither is getting ourselves killed. One way or another, we're gonna figure out how to pull this off. <sighs> okay, let's start with how we're gonna get there. Well, this isn't the first time we've had to get creative. We'll. We'll find a rocket. Okay, I, okay, come I'm on. loving your optimism. Let's try to be. What we have to do. Let's try to be. Thank you. 
All right, guys, it boils down to this. Those marked for Somehow ourselves. we've got to get to Helios, infiltrate Hyperion, and steal Gordus's Vault Beacon. Sorry, that was breakfast. <clears throat> Sorry. Without getting ourselves killed. That no shit, you. moron. I just said that like 30 seconds ago. Everyone knows what we have to do. We're just trying to figure out how to do it. Okay, okay. <laughs> if you stop being so negative, maybe we can How's your make tum -tum some there, buddy? That'll sword. teach you to hit the I taco do, truck. Right now, I don't see how that's gonna <sighs> wow, you we'll got the magic, together, kid. They should bottle the stuff. So Call it weak wrong. sauce. And that's why we have to drill mm. down no, no, I'm sure there's, there's great lost. in there somewhere. We just, just gotta keep looking. The one forcing us hey, I have an idea. Get lost. Well, last I checked, we were stuck together, kiddo, so I suggest you play nice, because you are gonna need my help. Pretty sure I told you to go away. Got and I forgive here. you, but you we gotta work on your manners, kid. Yeah, I didn't like know him. We've had we our differences, and I'll <laughs> admit I can get pretty grouchy when Fine. I don't get my What's own way. Then? But to maximize I, our chances, I don't know. I'm ready but to bury you. It's a metaphorical hatchet, especially because I know I don't really have any hands right now. Which is a real bitch, I tell you what. Yeah. Going to be this very hatchet. Yeah. You're gonna say up your ass, aren't you? Too late. Live in your shittiness. Yeah, what I'm saying is this. I got your beacon somewhere in my office. Get in there. I see. It's mission accomplished, baby. I just don't see how we're gonna do this. You don't get that beacon. You're all as good as dead. You're not helping. Oh, great. Captain Obvious wants to speak. Hmm. Uh, yeah. I believe I have some information that is relevant to your interests. The beacon is in Handsome Jack's office. You pulled that out of your ass. Well, check no. it out, smart guy. Run it by Gordis. Fine. Hey, put the little robot on. Listen, you got access to a map of Helios? I do. See if you can focus your scan for the beacon in Handsome Jack's old office. Let's see what we have here. Enhance? Mm. Oh, so you can say. <laughs> you shouldn't. I wouldn't know how. That whole sector must be crawling with guards. Hey, give me one reason why you think we could possibly break in. Mm. <laughs> how many people you gotta kill to get an office like that? Let's see. Billions. I get that you're scared. Hey, mm. I am too, but working together, I think we have a shot. Great, sign me up. Oh, I have no idea what I just did. Teamwork, that's how. Then you better have a damn good plan. Oh, it's killer. And Behold, this is amazing. Helios. Okay. Amazing. Now, how do we get there? Oh well, the Helios is in space, so we need a spaceship, obviously. Well, we don't exactly have one lying around. Hey, what about Scooter? He said we could call him any time. Hmm. Yeah, that's a uh, well. You got yourself a rocket man, miss. Idea. <clears throat> and then it's off to Helios. Pandora, we have lift off. Before and we dock, I'll tell a vet we've arrived. This is uh, really. Why not call her now? To turn now the less badly. she knows, the safer I know. she is. I just know. Yvette, it. we're back. Awesome, Reese. You're a hero. I'll tell the guards to let you through. At ease, soldier. Then I'll it's not going the to be that system. easy. It's not uh, going to be that easy. I just know it. Yeah, it'll work. Fiona, you'll take Sasha and Gordis and go to the hub of heroism. Now, up on Helios, Jack's office is a museum. Hallowed ground. Not even Vasquez had access. Looks like the only sure access is the VIP tour. Meet your new tour guides. <laughs> you don't uh, look uh, there, anything we'll like that. Jack's office. We're all... <laughs> Hang on. Uh, you'll need me for that, obviously. Once inside, Gordis will ID the piece. Wow! This place is huge! This way, please! And to the victors go the spoils. Told you. <laughs> Killer plan. 
<laughs> Wait a minute. How Not are you going to pull any of this off? Hyperion wants you dead. Then I better go as someone else. Oh. That's kind of grim. And for the grand finale... I'll digestruct a vast skies. <laughs> but Hyperion's gonna want proof that Reese is dead. We'll use Vasquez's body. They'll never know the difference. This could actually maybe work. So I guess all that's left is pitching the plan to Valerie. She'll go for it. And getting me to Old Haven. And I'll go to Scooters. Wait a second. Hmm? So how did you figure out the pieces in Jack's office? Don't tell him, Princess. <clears throat> He'll sabotage the whole freaking mission. It just came out of nowhere. Mm. Don't do it. You'll only make things way worse. Memory files. Well, it only took me a minute to search my memory files. Why am I doing oh, this? What do you know? It was right there all along. Huh. Sounds. Technology. Why am I doing? I love it. Why am I doing this? Why am I helping Jack? Reese. If there's no something idea. you need to get off your chest, we're listening. You gotta admit, you were acting pretty strange after we got out of the security office. Yeah, but I'm, what we're I'm saying going is to that be even if we could figure out a way to undertake this mission, next we time. need to know you're a hundred percent. Which you're clearly not. We're worried about you. Yeah, it definitely seems like something's up. Here's why you don't need to worry. Because we're friggin' Team Awesome! And August, that's why. Together, nothing can stop us. Huh? Bring it in. For the real thing, let's hug it out. Um, Don't no. look at me. I'll kill you. <laughs> go team! <laughs> Alright, Valerie mm. signed up on the plan. Reese is going with Finch and Kroger. The rest of us are off to Hollow Point to get this thing spacey. Let's get to work. I'm uh, I'm just confusing August. myself. Watch Gordis. I'll miss you. Just hurry up. I don't like being alone with this thing. <gasps> but I like you so much. <laughs> I can see why you don't like that. Hey, have you got a plan for what to say to Scooter? Cause he screwed him out of a lot of money for those caravan repairs. He could be angry. Let's hope not. And I've heard stuff about what he did to the Zafford clan. He's a pretty jolly guy for someone who just buried another man alive. Let's keep up the Just stick to the old con. We're professional racers. He looks like he lives on a diet of car exhaust and old ham. I doubt he'll see through it. He does smell like ham. Ha! There's a living, breathing Brian Fiona. Looking as fresh in her new duds as any gentle lady I ever seen. Come to see your old sponsor, huh? How go the races? I know you sure like going fast. <laughs> Wait, no, not like you're a fast woman mm. or. Oh shoot. Uh, like yeah, racing, great to see you too. Veins, is all I'm saying. I'll shut up. Scooter, great to see you. Just an absolute pleasure. Every time I get to see your face, just. Mm -hmm. huh. Go on. <laughs> Nah, you don't have to go on. I know my face is about as appealing as a dead dog. Somebody whacked a few times with a tire iron until it popped. But anyway, it's great to see you. What can I do you for? Not saying that I want to do you or nothing. No, it's, uh, well, not that I'm saying I wouldn't either. Uh, would one of you like open mm. your mouths and make with the wording so I can, I can shut mine? I mean, my uncle Yeah, we are going to space. We are going to space. What? I love space. It's like my fourth favorite thing. <laughs> behind tacos, trucks, and heavy eye contact. That mm. all sounds great. Only problem is funding. No, don't worry about it. Valerie will pay for whatever we need to get to Helios, get the Gordas piece, and get out. I understood exactly half those words. Let's do it. Okay. That oh, was wait, easier I than I that thought. There was only one problem. I meant that there were two. Because look, of course I there know is. a lot about cars and I know a lot about engines. But rockets are right out of my purview. 
My business partner knows rockets like you wouldn't believe. But she's, uh, she's a little out of sorts. Oh, no. Oh, you dear. Chinese been yeah. like that since she heard about some big bald hunter fight what happened out in the tundra. Athena ain't checked in for a while. She put two and two together. She ain't in much of a mood to do rocket stuff. Maybe you should talk to her, Fee. You're the last one who saw Athena, right? Yeah. And I don't even need remember about it. Hi, Hi Janie. Janie. Hi, hat girl. She said it was just an easy protection job. As if anything's ever easy out here. That's I really true. wanted to believe her. I did. But she forgot to turn her echo off the last time we spoke. Oh. I heard the two of you talking. Her echo went dead after the fighting started. I couldn't... What was she doing? Why did she lie to me? To I need to you. know. I know she was protecting you, but why? She said it wouldn't be dangerous. She said... She, she was, was training me. Training me. For what? To be a vault hunter. She wasn't putting herself in danger for her own sake. She was teaching me how to survive. She wouldn't do something like that out of the goodness of her heart. An old friend of ours hired her. Yeah? And where's he? Dead. Oh, hell. Athena. So what happened to her exactly? I've never seen Athena lose a fight. How'd she get grabbed? So long as she's got that mm. shield, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on her. She it was saving make sense. me. She can't... Damn it. She was saving my life. Valerie threw two Vault Hunters and her entire gang at Athena, but she held them off. She only surrendered to stop them from killing me. Your girlfriend is a hero. <laughs> I know. Ha ha ha. This is kind of awkward. Change the subject. These nice ladies want us to build a rocket for them? What do you <clears> say? I don't know if I've got the parts. Sure you mm. do. Come on. You just got I just want to know one last thing, and then I'll see about the rocket. Did she... Say anything. I don't them? remember, did she? Before they took her. The way she acted, sometimes I didn't even know if she liked me. Like maybe I was just a fluke or something. Yeah, well, let's go need to hear with this. this. Sorry. She told me to pass on a message. She said she loves you. She I did. I don't know I... if this is true or not. Uh, oh. Because I don't remember Goodness. exactly that the okay. last uh, part of. Oh, wow. Young lady, you are going to have yourself a rocket. And once I'm done building it, I'm going to grab every gun I can carry, I'm going to drive out of here, I'm going to rescue my girlfriend, and I'm going to marry the piss out of her. I'm in. I can probably build you something that'll break Atmo, but beyond that, you'll want a mechanic on board to make sure it doesn't explode on you. Oh, man. That sounds like a job for the school man if I ever heard one. <laughs> and considering it's a dream of mine to catch a ride into space and all that, it would be like just, just wow. The are space what do mechanic. You say, ladies? Scooter, want to come with? The <laughs> are onboard mechanic? You mean it? Whoa, space buddies! 